Oh, can you guys see me? I have camo on. I didn't think you could see me. <laughs> I'm gonna put that in. I'm gonna put that in. Okay. Hey guys, it's Adam, Elizabeth, and Miss Zoe here with Happy Holland, and we have another Dollar Tree haul for you. It's kind of a personal care with some other random items thrown in. But before we get into the haul, if you are not currently subscribed, please consider subscribing to our channel. We're so excited. We have 170 subscribers. It's crazy. That's so awesome. Thank you guys so, so much. We love it. We do. And it's amazing to see it growing. Yeah. And we're just doing this for fun. So we're glad that you guys are enjoying it and we appreciate all of you. Yeah, we do. And don't forget to hit the like button. It helps our channel continue growing. So let's get into the haul. First of all, I found this really cool bubble mailer and I loved the pink with the, uh, what's the word again? We have a hard this time. This is like a pearly something. Ha. Pearlescent is a word I usually use, but I don't think. So. Holographic. Oh, maybe holographic, yeah. That yeah. might be more accurate to what's happening here. So I picked that up. I thought That's pretty it'll cool. come in handy sometime. And they have a lot of different colors. They Nine had, inches by six inches. They had uh, green, blue, gold, silver, and pink. So I picked up a pink. And then also I picked up another cell phone case. This is traditional animal print. And she has been using the other ones. Have you, have you have. liked them? Um, I like them a lot. Um, I don't typically drop my phone a lot, so that's something that plays to my advantage. I'm using the one that I got. Yeah. You can maybe now actually see the uh, wood, wood grain. grain, maybe, maybe. Mubba. Anyway, um, got mine. It, it seems good quality. Mm -hmm. I think that the button press, when I'm pressing the power button, it feels better than it did when I first got it. I don't know if it's kind of like broken in, but like the first couple days, I, I do a lot of work meetings and I have them call my phone or I have the, the software call my phone and I'll be uh, turning off my screen. And I, if you have an iPhone, if you double press the power button, it hangs up the call. So I, uh, I was hanging up calls a lot the first couple days. So um, just be aware, it may need to break in. It doesn't, I don't seem to be doing that anymore, but. Yeah. It was it was kind of a concern of mine at the beginning. I just kind of avoided touching it after that. Okay, so moving along, I got some more magnets because I've got a project that I'll be doing with them shortly. A magic. He is so magic. There were, you guys didn't know there were two packs. What? What? And I did pick up some different flossers for me. Uh, the ones that I got um, some time ago at Dollar Tree, they work, but I think that these will be easier to get in because I have a real small mouth. So I think it'll be easier yeah, to do. get in. It's really difficult. And I got a pill cutter, you guys. Uh, you know, are we in that stage in life? We're in that stage. I take um, uh, a lot of vitamins and my zinc pill I need to cut in half. I want to open this. And so I figured this would just be an easy way to help me do that. It, is it have a... Place pill here. And it literally has a razor there's, blade. There's, Don't hurt yourself. almost got myself. There's a blade up here. So then you just go crunch. And then you have two pills now. So I thought that was pretty cool. And for only a dollar, that's a great deal. Okay. And now we'll get into some of the more fun stuff, in my opinion. So I don't know if you guys have seen these. They are the Diamond Cosmetics. It says toe on the go. And they're like little pedicure sets. So you get a cuticle pusher. You get two of the little um, foam toe spacers and a full-size nail file. They had them in multiple uh, patterns, I guess. So I yep. got this leopard print with the green. 
I got this blue with the uh, diamonds. And then I also got this like Hawaiian leafy one. Mm. So I like that color of orange. I just thought they were really cool. And like, how cute would that be to like pick up a nail polish and pick up one of those and maybe a little Epsom salt or something and have it be like a little goodie bag. I need a cuticle pusher for my cuticles here. Okay, well, I'll make you a goodie bag. <laughs> and then I've noticed that they're starting to get some new hair products. So I just picked a, a few up. So I got this pack of three, they're calling them salon clips. And I thought that those were nice colors. They're just like really wide alligator clips. Yeah. So I thought those were cute. And then I got three packs of barrettes. So I got like the browns, black, tan, and gray set. And then I got this various colors of blue and gray. And then these like mauve and mint green kind of colors. So I thought those were cool. Yeah. I hadn't seen them before. They may not be new, but I just hadn't seen them before. They also had like matching ponytails, like I think little ones and larger ones. So, oh, I found another uh, health item. I got this Vapo inhaler. He, Adam was just talking to me a long time ago. We had gotten the Vicks branded one and he really liked it. And so when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, I'd much rather pay a dollar than however much the VIX one was. Yeah. It was I agree. not, I don't, it wasn't super expensive, but you know, like when you're sick, you just, you're almost willing to pay anything for something. So let's give this a test. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Like, That'll open up the nostrils and maybe make you cry a little bit. <laughs> like, oh, but in a good, in a good way. <laughs> in a good way. Crying in joy that you can breathe. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This time of year, because it's cold, you got the heater on and it just dries out, uh, at least my sinuses. And uh, I, need, I need something to help open it back up a little. Okay, and you guys, now we're getting into some makeup items. So I was really uh, excited to see this L'Oreal Infallible Paints Metallics. I only got one of them, but they did have multiple colors available. I just got the one that I thought I would be most likely to wear because they even had like a teal color one. They had like a dark burgundy. Um, this one they call it galactic foil. Yeah, you can open it. It's. Oh, did it come like that? I guess so. Where's your hand? Oh, whoa, that's a little darker than mama thought. <laughs> Turn the brush the other way. Let me go. Okay, you got it. Yeah. You're professional. Holy smokes. That's really pretty though. Scaring me. I don't know if the color's coming off good there, but. It looks more coppery there, but it's definitely um, very similar to the yeah. color of. Well, even in even in the video, I don't know if that color's really coming across. Oh, they, if I hold it like this angle, you see that color? That's that's the kind of tone we're talking about. It's it's a nice pink, metallic-y looking. And then I found this CoverGirl Exhibitionist Liquid Glitter Eyeshadow in Twinkle Town. I was thinking, man, that would be a real party for like New Year's or, you know, some Christmas holiday parties, if, if those happen anymore. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so, let's see. Okay. Does it smell? No, it doesn't. Are you gonna spill? Oh, it's not smelling. I did. So it's eyeshadow. It is eyeshadow. So it's gonna have to dry, right? But you guys can see the sparkles and it's like, it's a multicolor glitter. It's not just all silver. So that is party. 
And then I found another flower uh, Miracle Matte Metallic Liquid Lip in the color Petal Punk. I'm not gonna open this one, but it is beautiful. It's got kind of a uh, gold flake looking Coppery. thing going on there, so. It's real party. Yeah. And then I found two of these NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. I got uh, Ibiza and Soul. So obviously these are after um, places in the world. I am gonna open these. I know that I like this NYX um, lip product. I've gotten it before at Ulta. So I was actually really excited to only pay a dollar for these. So, so awesome. I'll get it open by the time you're done with that one. Look at that! Goodness. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Wow. Oh. Look how vibrant it is. Love it. This one, it's gonna be just like that. It's gonna be super vibrant. Oh yeah. Wow. That's very purple. Okay. Look at that. Oh my gosh, those are so pretty. These two. So definitely if you see these, they are well worth a dollar. I love how matte they are. It's like they go on your lips and they do stay on for a good amount of time without like coming off like when you're eating or, or snacking, whatever. And so this is the last item in today's haul. It is another t-shirt and I got it oversized again, but it's this pretty pink. Um, it's like a heather. Heathered pink. And look at it, it goes so beautifully with my makeup wow. swatches. You planned that. I, sure. Um, so just pick these up. I always try to look through the shirts when we're at Dollar Tree. Um, I'm wearing that Dollar Tree yes. long sleeve shirt I yeah. got, and mm -hmm. it fits very nicely. Mm-hmm, yeah. It does fit pretty good, and the sleeves are a good length. Man. They're long enough. Can't beat it for a dollar, you guys. So that was our haul, um, and let's see. Question, question. What is your favorite breakfast food? Comment below. What is your favorite? My favorite breakfast food, um, I love two different things. I love hash browns and I love biscuits and gravy. I don't have them very often, but I love them. What is your favorite breakfast food? And by food, you mean like a dish? You heard what I said, what is okay. yours? I know what it is. I have two favorites. One of them is Eggs Benedict. One of them is Eggs Benedict. I do like that a lot. Uh, certain places make it really well and certain places don't. It's, it'll be, it's like good, but it's like an all right. It's like passable. Okay, what's the other thing? The other thing, and I rarely have this, but it's always been my favorite, which is French toast. Oh, okay. It has been a while. Yeah. It's been a long time since I've really had French toast. That's because every time we go somewhere to have breakfast, he gets eggs benedict. I get eggs benedict instead of ordering french toast and french toast is something that's more easily I don't made think, at home yeah and i don't think that at least i never believed that you really like french toast that much I don't. Mm -hmm. and the kids have never really tried it they like pancakes so it's i've never had a reason to make it i am one of those crazy people who does not like pancakes i don't like french toast i don't like waffles I'm crazy, I'm sorry. One of these days I'll have my kids try French toast and they'll love it. And then they will like it. And then uh, I'll be able to get it more regular. Make it yourself more regularly. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm tired. <laughs> He's been working a lot. So on that note, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment your favorite breakfast food and I'm looking forward to reading those. And until the next haul, we hope you're having a great day. Happy hauling. Bye, guys. Hey, Elizabeth. Where'd you go? Adam. Can, hold on, though.
Can you see it? Can you see how tired I look?